Testing, testing, Patrick is the best skier on the mountain. Got it? Patrick Holgren doesn't take life too seriously. So explain the getup. Uh, probably, I mean, I always like the tight and bright look. I've always been wearing interesting outfits, but after you lose a leg, you basically, you are so recognizably disabled and you stick out so much in public that I just roll with it. That's because nine years ago, a serious motorcycle crash nearly took his life. Had a, a moment of, of hope that I would probably live. And that is, that's really the last thing I remember. Do you feel like it brought you a new perspective? It's like I know something that most people don't, where there's a direct correlation between struggle and success. And it's right in front of our noses, but we, um, we don't always see it. His struggle came from learning to ski on only his right leg. The success? That came after he trusted both his twin brother Sven and his father to teach him to adapt to his new predicament. It made me feel human again because I could do things that most people with two legs could do. After moving to Colorado in 2016, it didn't take long to discover his talent ceiling. And yeah, I've been telling everybody and their brother that I'm, I'm the best, so it's about time I actually got good. Not just good, top North American giant slalom finisher at World Championships good. And now Holgren is competing in his first Paralympics, representing his family and country. I haven't been on the U.S. national team. I haven't really, you know, I haven't even had a speed suit that says USA on it. And uh, so now it's finally the time for me to actually give back. Is it ready? In Winter Park. One, two. Ariel Orsuto, Nine News.